All right, in this video, I'm gonna to try to show you how to do a UserBob mobile hit on a iOS device. I'm using a iPod Touch. And I've already accepted a hit. This is a dollar 31 minute screencast of a mobile website. So the first thing we're gonna do is come down here to click here to get started. And the screen shows um, a page with two buttons. One, it says uh, tap here on the mobile device, and one says click here on the computer to display the text. So to get this page on my mobile device, I am using uh, Pushbook because it's a really long, ugly URL. I don't want to have to try to type that in. But if I use push bullet, I can just, this is my device, I can just share the URL is pre-populated here by just clicking on this arrow. And now on my device, it just gets a notification and I can tap on that to open it. And now what I want to do is, uh, the page is actually displayed here in Pushbook, but I really want it in the browser. It displays a little nicer. So there's a share button and then I say open in browser. So now we have the user Bob page opening up in the browser. It's the same page that's displayed on the screen. So now I can tap on that button that says tap here on mobile. And so that's opening there. Um, on the computer, I'm gonna click on the, click here on computer to display text to read aloud. So that's the, the text that we're gonna get started. We're ready now to actually start recording our, our iPod screen. So I'm going to go ahead and bring up QuickTime um, to the Launchpad, QuickTime, there it is. And what we want to do is go to File and do a new movie recording. And hello. But we want to change the input, which is this little arrow to the right of the red record button. And... Pick our pink iPod touch. Okay, so in a second, now we have the iPod touch is displayed here. It's in uh, portrait mode. There it goes into landscape. And so we are actually, did we press the button to start recording? We picked it. We just need to click on the red record button to actually start recording. So we're click start recording and now we want to do this read out loud which is on the computer pretend you did a search on your phone and the first search result brought you to the site so we'll click the display instructions and timer so now we got the timer on the computer and the instructions that we can see and we're recording the phone so instructions say talk about your first impression of the website so I think the website looks okay um, kind of long scrolling and some buttons don't quite fit. So it's not, doesn't quite look mobile ready. And when we finish our recording, then we want to get back up the QuickTime player on, on the Mac. And so we bring that back up. And when you hover your mouse over here, you'll get the video controls and we can just click on the stop button. Okay, so we have stopped the file, the, recording at this point and now all we need to do is have the file that is our recording uploaded back over here on that user Bob page so let's see what we get all right to save the movie we can from the file menu pick file saved and pick where we're going to save it and this is untitled move. I'm just going to make it UB so I know what it's called. UB.move. So that is saved. Where it's saving. And now back on the user Bob page, we want to choose file. It was on our desktop. There it is, UB.move. We just pick it. It's displayed here. And we can click on upload review. And it is uploading. And when it's done, it'll give us the completion code that we just copy and paste 
back into our Mechanical Turk page. So it's really pretty simple to do the hit if you have a Mac, the Lightning cable, and an iOS device.